Gemini, welcome to your November tarot forecast with me. My name is Brooke and welcome to Luna Faith Tarot. This reading is for all that is born under the sign of Gemini, Sun Rising, as well as your Moon sign. If you'd like to book a private reading with me, you can email me at lunafaithtarot at gmail.com. I also have a link to my website in the description box below. You can check out the readings that I do offer. However, I always do my readings for now on through email I will send you an invoice it's much more secure so please check out the readings that I do offer Gemini for this month judgment has appeared for your theme this is your theme or the atmospheric elements position for your reading for November judgment is also about the Phoenix rising out of its ashes it's a complete reawakening it's a makeover you've gone through something and this is the month where you're going to appear you're going to come out of it you're going to reinvent yourself and it's also a time of a new phase for you so definitely for Gemini a new awakening a rebirth transformation of some kind is noted for you as well so judgment major arcana for the theme for the month is very strong for Gemini for November going forward in your present position we see the four of cups however you're still a bit jaded in terms of there's something being offered to many of you but you're just not wanting to take it you're not seeing it it may be right in front of you emotionally you may be a bit guarded emotionally you may be a bit jaded as well you're not satisfied with whatever's being offered to you at this moment for many of those that are watching the Four of Cups is discontent, it could be boredom, it could be uh, just not feeling it, you know, it could be the best thing in the world, but for whatever reasons, emotionally, Gemini, many of you are just kind of like, eh, I don't know, I'm not feeling it, or I'm just going to sit here and be in my funky mood. So many of you may not be wanting to take what is being offered to you this month, that is the message. And, and maybe something that you may have felt towards the end of October as well. There is an opportunity for Gemini, but you may not be seeing it at this moment. Now going forward, we see the Nine of Pentacles, and this is in your past position. So Gemini, yes, you've regained your independence. Yes, you've regained yourself in terms of stability. Many of you may also, especially Gemini women, may be feeling more independent in the month of November. Perhaps there was a breakup. Perhaps you've broken free from something in particular. Also, you may be also feeling more financially independent from a partner, more financially stable as well. That's notable. This also can apply for Gemini men. So financial stability has been noted for you, especially coming out of the past position. It's also a great card of solitude, feeling comfortable in your skin again, and being on your own, which is a great validator in terms of rebirth, transformation, wanting to reinvent yourself, wanting to start over the phoenix from the ashes. So many of you may be feeling this in the month of November. In your challenge position, there's still some sort of burden that you're carrying. This is a load of some kind. This could even involve children. This can involve more than one project. This can involve responsibilities that you're taking on, or perhaps now that the person is gone or the person is not there, you're having to shoulder more responsibilities. The challenge is you're still pursuing it. You're driven, you're going to carry on, and you're pushing your way forward, and you're pushing your way through it, Gemini. That's the message, so keep going, and maybe weighing you down sometimes, the message is to keep going for November. It, the burden is there, it's been validated to you, it is in your challenge position, but the message is for Gemini, keep pushing and keep pursuing and keep going. In the outcome, we see some things coming in, invitations, this also could be opportunities for new emotions and love, this could be a potential new relationship coming in for Gemini, especially in the month of December. The Knight of Cups is all about movement, direction, potentials for new relationships, potentials for new emotions. This could even be rekindled emotions as well. There's an opportunity or a gift coming for Gemini, possibly for many of those that are watching, of potentials for new love, new relationships on its way. So 
this time of transformation and reinvention is going to serve you well, Gemini, because you're on the path towards something new. There's much direction coming in for you, and none of you seem to be looking back. <laughs> you're kind of like, poof, okay, thank you, moving on. <laughs> So there's definitely movement and new direction for you emotionally, which is very positive to see, and you're very much driven and courageous and pushing forward, and you're going to be re rewarded, especially at month's end potentially, and going into the month of December. So that's very exciting, Gemini. So Gemini, keep me posted. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great month, and I'll speak to you soon.